Hello and welcome to the Magic Pencil. My name's Andrew and this is Finn from Adventure Time aka Tor. And today we're going to be doing a tutorial on how to draw, what are we drawing? Percy from Thomas and Time Kitchen. From Thomas and Friends. If you've got any comments and suggestions, don't forget to drop them in the box below. Are you ready to draw? Yes. Let's get started. I've got a black pen here. And what we're going to do about a third of the way up along here, we're just going to draw a long straight line. Like that. Okay. Right, so this is, what's it called? The running boards? Is that what it's called? The train tracks. No, no, it's not the train track. Train tracks are going to be down here. So oh. actually we'll draw another good point. I'm going to draw another straight line about there. Like that. Excellent. Okay. So at this end, I'm going to do a line going down. And at this end, I'm going to do a line going down. Like that. Okay. And then just along a little bit, I'm going to do another little line about here. And then we're going to join these up together. Now you need to make it a little bit wider because we've got to put the buffers on there. Okay. So let's do about that big. Okay. And then here, I'm going to do a slightly smaller line like that. And I'm going to join it up like that. And then on this side, I'm going to draw another little line like that. <coughs> and see where this line was? I'm going to carry along that way like that okay and then I'm going to go down and just do another little line there and then I'm going to join like that like that okay now let's try and do Thomas's body so about here it's not Thomas sorry not Thomas very good Percy so here I'm going to draw a line Going up like you that. You must have got confused enough. I off. did get confused. First, Thomas did Yeah, Tankington. we did first, we did Thomas, and this is Percy now. Okay, so now I'm going to draw a line running parallel to this line, just to about there. And then I'm going to do another little line going up, and then another little line going across, and then I'm going to draw a straight line from about here, going all the way down like that. Okay, then I'm going to draw a line going across like that. Then I'm going to go down to about here. So not as far down as that line, just along to there. Then I'm going to go across. And then this bit is going to join up to the back. Like that. Okay. So, see that line? I'm going to draw another little line like that and then like a letter T I'm going to get halfway I'm going to go all the way down to there okay now I'm just going to make this a little bit bigger so I'm going to draw another line along there like that and down okay and then on either side I'm going to do a line going down that way and yeah let's do a slightly small thinner line that way and then we can colour this in black. Okay. What are we going to do now? Right. We've got the basic shape of the cab there. Okay. So, about here would be where, what's that called on the engine? Is it a cylinder where the boiler would uh, be? The boiler, boiler. Okay, so we're gonna draw a straight line where the boiler would be, about there. Okay, you got that? And then on the end here, I'm gonna draw a circle. Okay, so hold on, I need to make my line go a little bit further along. And then I'm gonna draw a circle here. Like that, okay? So, the next thing to do is to draw a little line there and a little line there, and then another line there and another line there, okay? And we're gonna do like a curved line because it's almost like he's got little paws, okay? So I'm gonna do a curved line like that, and then up, and then I'm gonna do another little curved line like that, and then up. 
Now for Percy's face, I got it right that time, Percy. He's got a more sort of friendly face than Thomas. So what I'm going to do is going to do I slightly... I think Thomas is more friendly of a person. Really? Okay, but he doesn't have as big eyebrows. I think, is, is Percy supposed to be younger than Thomas? Yeah. Yes, I think he's maybe more childlike. Okay, so let's do a slightly curved line here, like that, for the bottom of his eye. And another slightly curved line like that, for the bottom of his eye. And then I'm going to do like an arch like that, and then another arch like that. Now Percy's got smaller eyebrows, so he's just really just a little dot above those arches, okay? And then we're going to do a little curve for his nose. And we're going to do a curved line that way for one cheek, and a curved line that way for the other cheek. I feel Thomas is more popular than Percy. You think so? Maybe. Yeah. I don't know. He's the, the show is named after Thomas, but Percy's quite an important character, isn't he? So we're going to do a curved smile like that. And then we're going to do another little line under there for the bottom lip. And he's got like a little dimple under his nose, so we're going to do that. Because if Percy wasn't there, it would just be called Thomas. It would be, because he needs friends, doesn't he? It's Thomas and friends. Okay, so let's do some little dots here for the eyes. Okay, like that. Now for where the face meets the boiler, Let's go like that, <coughs> and we are going to do like a curved line coming round like that, okay? Now I'm going to do the little, what's it called? Where does the steam come out of? A funnel. A funnel. So I'm just going to do a little rectangle like that there, and then a bigger rectangle on top, and then just like a little thick line like that. And then that's all going to be coloured in for that. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to do a curved line that way. It joins up there to there. And on here we need to do some like little he doesn't really have a dome, I don't know what they're called, but he's got some little bits that sit up on top. So I'm just going to do those like that. And then I'm going to draw a little line there. And then we're going to do an arch that connects those two together, like that. Okay? And then I'm going to do another straight line, and then another curve there. Okay? And then here, I'm just going to do like a diagonal line for the back of the coal tender, okay? And what am we gonna do now? We've got to do some banding. Okay, so this bit here sort of curves and connects like that. Here? Yeah, yeah from that here. side, yeah, to behind his head. And then we're gonna do some more curved lines like that, okay? Now, at the back, I'm just going to do Should I connect this to a curved that? line for the buffer. Should I connect that to this? Yeah, okay. Okay. Right. So, I need to do a straight line along there like that. Okay. <laughs> and here we're going to do a number six. So, I'm going to do a curve like that and then round. Wait, is it and bubble? It's, yeah, it's kind of bubbly. Yeah. And then up like that. And then I'm going to do a circle in the middle. Okay. Now we've got to do the wheels. So starting about here, I'm not going to do the top of the wheel because some of the wheels hidden underneath. Round like that. And then up like that. And on this side, Percy's only got four wheels. So I'm going to do the same again, round like that. Why does Percy have? Two wheels. It I makes him know. like a car with it's pistons. It's more like a car with pistons, yeah. Okay. So in the middle, I'm going to do a little circle there. And another little circle there. And then I'm going to do some lines coming out. Done. You done it? Fantastic. Okay. And then we're going to draw another circle 
inside like that and again another circle inside like that okay I mean a circle in a circle in a circle. circle inside a circle yep and then just along here I'm going to draw a straight line that way and that way and along there like that okay and then we've got the other wheel so I'm just going to draw another straight line which is the other rail going along like that and then I'm going to draw like a curve on that side between that two so that's the shadow of the other wheel and then on this side I'm going to do another curve going round like that okay and then here I'm going to draw a straight line there and a straight line there and then I'm going to kind of do like a C shape here and a C shape here straight line there straight line there straight line there you could just draw there. a circle there you could, you could do that yeah. I'm just trying to make it look like the um, die cast toys okay right so the next thing to do is to colour it in should we get busy? Wow, what an amazing drawing. Give me a high five. That is fantastic. Hope you enjoyed our tutorial. Please subscribe to our channel. And if you'd like to receive notifications, hit the bell button in the face because it beats me all night and day. How mean. Thank you for watching. We look forward to seeing you again soon. Goodbye. Bye.